79 year old Mizoram Chief Minister holding a street corner meeting for his party, the Mizo National Front or MNF, at Sifir village on the outskirts of capital Aizol. This area is part of his Aizol East 1 constituency. He brings up the unrest in neighboring Manipur. The three-time chief minister has not only sheltered thousands of internally displaced tribals from Manipur, but had taken a stand against the Manipur government led by BJP. Though an NDA ally, Zoram Thanga also took a stand against the centre by sheltering nearly 40,000 refugees from neighbouring Myanmar. We are not a partner with the BJP in election. We are only a member of ND in the national right. centre. In an issue like the Myanmar refugees, <coughs> government of India said that you should push them back. And the Bangladesh refugees, you should push them back. But we told them that we are just following what the central government has done many decades ago. Our stand in Manipur is a big, big plus point in the coming election. MNF swept the 2018 assembly polls, winning 27 of the 40 seats. Zuram Thanga's party has projected him as the guardian of the Chin Kukizo tribes of Northeast, even as the other parties, including BJP, have called him out on corruption, unemployment, drug menace and poor infrastructure. If anything bad happened and if BJP is to be blamed, Zoram Thanga will take part of the blame. Zoram has been under the MNF rule for such a long time. We had enough of them. Long before he joined politics, Zoram Thanga was a fighter in a Mizo insurgent group. After the 1987 Mizo Peace Accord, he joined politics and became a chief minister for the first time in 1998. Zoram Thanga has been veteran of many elections and fighting elections is nothing new for him. But this time around, in a multi-cornered fight, perhaps this is a tough battle for himself as well as his party, the Mizo National Front. But the veteran politician is confident that once again his party would be able to come back to power. From Sifir in Mizoram with Camp Person G.D. Shankar, Ratnadeep Chaudhary for NDTV.